uh, a lot of stronger guys and uh, uh, they came to play. So. How did that affect your decision making? Um, just, uh, I just knew I had to get rid of the ball faster and I couldn't hold the ball as long. And, um, that was my mentality. As soon as I stepped in the game, I just had to get rid of it fast. But, uh, um, yeah, so they were pretty good. Coach Longo mentioned you missed some throws and normally you've been hitting big throws. But did their aggressiveness on defense kind of affect how you were trying to get your accuracy on those throws? Um, I tried my best just to try to throw it over the top. They did well just defending um, um, just our outside receivers. And, uh, I could have made better throws and uh, could have given my receivers more chances. Um, it would have turned out a lot different. Jordan Coach said that he wants to make sure that this game doesn't beat you guys twice. How, yeah. As one of the leaders of this team, how do you make sure that you, as bad as tonight may be, you show up tomorrow and kind of put it in the rear view? Um, just as being a leader, everybody looks at you. So you just want to um, shake it off and come tomorrow. And um, just just short-term memory, just have short-term memory. And everybody else will follow you. And everybody else like, hey, if he's doing it, I'm going to do it. And um, that's how just overcoming uh, this loss will overcome us. And, uh, that's how we just look forward. A lot of people are going to wonder why you were in for every snap of the game, but yeah. both your head coach and your offensive coordinator said you didn't want to come out. You just yeah, wanted to be I, there early in. Yeah, I, I wanted to. I didn't want to quit. I didn't want to give up, and uh, I just fought um, the whole all four quarters. Tried to do my best, and uh, the best thing I can do is just learn from my mistakes and um, come out next week stronger than ever. And uh, I just promise you guys that this won't ever happen again um, on my side, the offense side, and just uh, this team in general. You mentioned their quickness, or did you think yeah. their quickness on the edge in particular flushed you out of the pocket earlier than you usually? Yeah, um, I just felt I just had the time clock in my head, and um, I see pressure around me, so I try to escape as fast as I can or um, try to find an open receiver. But definitely, they did um, have speed on the outside and uh, they bring pressure. So. How are you feeling, Coach? Said you got nicked up a little bit. Yeah, um, just on that fumble, I. Um, could have slid, but I wanted to get that first down. But uh, yeah, just a little bumps and bruises. Will you be in protocol this week, Jordan? Do you know? No, I'll, I'll, I'm gonna be fine. No, what was hurting after that about right now? But what was it like just walking out to a stadium that had lays out for everyone, yeah. just kind of celebrating your culture? Um, it was pretty awesome, just experiencing that and everybody having it in the Walk of Champions. And I was super grateful that the fans were supportive. And, um, it was a big game for them, big game for us. And uh, it was just awesome seeing that laid out. What was the biggest difference in their secondary and the ones you faced previously? Um, they're a lot. Um, they, they can play man-to-man, -man and um, they're, they're a lot more physical and um, a lot more faster. Um, put the ball, put their hands in the right spot um, when the ball, before the ball comes down. So um, that's basically the difference in their speed and um, their ability to change directions. Join that first play of the game was, was that pre, was that pre called? You guys knew that going in, or did, was it based on coverage? Or yeah, it was just based on coverage. Um, it was depending on what the safeties would do. So I seen them coming down, so I kind of protected myself with the O line, and um, I knew DK was one on one, so I kind of hit that, and um, that was exciting seeing them catching. Them. After that, did you, were you like, man, this this could be a really really good night? Yeah, after that, I was super confident. Um, the whole team was confident in all of us. And, um, we just needed to keep driving, and we had a nice run the second series, uh, up, to, up until that fun day.